Welcome back to Awesome Camps and today we have another great opportunity for you to get to know what's going on with the auto industry. And today we're going to talk about this particular vehicle right here, the Mazda CX-30 and the views that you're having in this background video comes from My Cars Info. It's a buddy of mine from South Carolina who does videos on 4K and he has one of the best views in the auto industry. I love the way he uses the 4K camera on his videos. So take a look and go and subscribe on his channel. But before that, I would like you to take a look on Awesome Camps on Facebook and Coach underscore Oscarillo on Instagram and subscribe right here on the YouTube channel right now for you to get the latest news on the auto industry. And remember to hit the bell button to get the notifications of the latest uh, post from Ozzy Camps. So today we're talking about the prices of the Mazda CX-30, which it comes now with a 2.5 turbo engine that you will be able to enjoy very, very much. This one is coming with 250 horsepower and also 310 pound-feet of torque if you're using premium gas. If you're using regular gas, it's gonna give you 226 horsepower, horsepower and 295 pound-feet of torque, which is very convenient for you to get to use two different gasolines on this particular vehicle. You don't have to miss and hear the pinging when you're not using the actual correct gasoline on those vehicles. So starting with $29,000 on the turbo version, that will be the basic model of the turbo. Then you will move up to up to $33,900 for the premium plus on the Mazda CX-30. That's a hefty price for a, what is known a Mazda 3 on stilts, but this is the trend right now. Every car company are bringing vehicles on this size and this height just to get to sell. Like the Mercedes A-Class, the GLA, the BMW X1, those vehicles are right there. And that's what Mazda is trying to do. They're aiming towards the luxury brands and they're trying to get to work with them and compete with them since the 90s with the 929 and the Mazda Millennia. So these ones are gonna have the, the top models are gonna have leather wrap steering wheel, chrome interior accent, chip, uh, leather shift knob, heated front seat, power moonroof, frameless auto diming rear, rear view mirror, and exterior upgrades with the 18 inches rims. So the Mazda CX-30 Turbo also is gonna come in the premium, premium plus packages, which are gonna give you the, the exclusive turbo models of 32,300 on the premium, and 12 speakers of both sound system, leather seats, heated steering wheel with paddle shifters. The Premium Plus is gonna bump that up with the traffic jam assist, 360 degree camera, and auto dimming driver's side mirrors. And much more. And that's something that we have to take in consideration with the Mazda 630. It's in a different category, aiming towards the big hitters on the auto industry. So right now, this Mazda is coming in three premium colors, which is the Soul Red Crystal with a 595 price on top of the regular price, the Machine Gray Metallic for 495, and the Snowflake White Pearl Mica on 395. The added features are nice to the CX-30 that's welcome in the auto industry because this vehicle has been well, well received by the auto industry and the customers. This one's are gonna come equipped with Mazda Eye Active designs. And basically, these ones are gonna be all-wheel drive system and also six-speed manual transmission. And that's giving you a good, good value for the money right now. So that's something that you need to take in consideration, the Mazda CX-30, CX because right now, that's where we're going to. Like, coupes and sedans are a thing of the past. So let's take a look on the pictures of the Mazda CX-30. Let me show you some pictures right here of the turbo model. I'm gonna bring it back here to the shot. Look at this, the all-wheel drive model, Skyactiv Turbo. Very, very pretty. That's a nice looking vehicle. Nothing aggressive, nothing too much. It's very, very aggressive. Let me, oh, I'm in the shop, guys. So. I'm so like loving this vehicle right now. So very, very nice looking, not much like blows and whistles on the outside, but I think it gives a look of an Audi. Like it looks very much like the Audis. Uh, some people talk about that the Mazda CX-30 is just a Mazda 3 in stilts. Well, it gives that look, but it has some like 
distinctive designs that it gives it away that is not the Mazda 3. And I actually like that cut up on the window in the back right here in the back seat. It's much, much better looking than the Mazda 3. The one part that I don't like much is the part on the rubber area for the off-roading and make it look like it's taller. Uh, I think that's a gimmick like this right here. I do not enjoy that look. If that can be painted on the on the body, on the collar body design, I would probably choose to do that. But I don't know if it comes as an option. But this is it for Oz and Kems, and I will see you guys in another videos for news in the Mazda CX-30 or any other cars that are coming back. Maybe some retro Mazda's uh, 929 Mazda Millennia, maybe the return of the Millennia. I don't know. Probably that will be a great idea to Mazda for Mazda to bring that vehicle back because it used to be a really nice vehicle. So don't forget to subscribe now for more news. Hit the like button on Facebook and follow me on Instagram. I will see you guys next time for more news.